clutch 14 for the year, guys. I know, I see that slug, but I'm telling you this time, it's not just a full slug clutch, even though we've had a lot of them this year. There are some good eggs under there because we saw them when she was laying. Uh, so this is our banana female bred to our pastel pinstripe yellow belly desert ghost het pied male. So really cool stuff. Everything's going to be het desert ghost and 50% het pied. And she didn't lay last year for us, so I doubt there'd be any chance of sperm retention. So should all be from him. Let's get her off here and see what we got. All right, not exactly what we were hoping for, but you know what? At least we got good eggs out of this clutch because this has been a year of not so great clutches. Uh, so she laid 10. As you can see, there are four good ones out of those 10, which is better than none, which has been a lot of our clutches this year. So we're just thankful that we'll get something, hopefully. We'll see in 55 days. Uh, they're big eggs, 125 grams an egg. Those are big eggs. Um, it's hard to tell from the video, of course, but that weight, if you watch our other ones, is a like 25 grams or 35 grams more than a lot of eggs are. So those are big eggs. Um, so we are going to go ahead and get these in the incubator and we'll be back with the cutting here in 55 days. All right, guys, clutch number. Holly, do you remember the clutch number? <laughs> uh, I want to say 14. Yes. Clutch, I was right. Yes. Clutch Yay. number 14. So this is our banana female to our lesser pastel pinstripe. Desert Ghost Het Pied Male. So everything is going to be 100% Het Desert Ghost, 50% Het Pied. Um, really what we want to hit is anything banana out of this is a win for us. We want to get some um, bananas from her because they're either going to be female bananas, which would be nice, uh, or they'll be males, but they'll be female makers. So either one is a win for us. So let's see what we got. As always, if, you haven't, if this is your first video from us, get prepared to get used to beeping in the background. Uh, that's our incubator because we've just pulled these out of the incubator in the other room that loud. But, you know, the good news is you get warnings when your incubator snaps too low. So what can we get? Uh, pastel, pinstripe, yellow belly. I don't, did I say lesser for him? That's not right. He's a pastel, pinstripe, yellow belly, desert ghost. Het. He's a pastel, pastel, pastel pinstripe, pinstripe, yellow belly, belly. desert ghost, het pied. Yes. What is that craziness? Well, clearly that's a pinstripe. Is that? I I don't know what that is. I got no clue. Pinstripe. Zoom in just a little bit. Um. Oh. Yeah, I guess we'll see when he comes out. Yeah. He or she comes out. Yeah, I don't know. Sorry for the wobbly camera, guys. I can tell you pinstripe, and that's it. I would say probably pastel, as light as it is. Um, the belly's Did pretty, I can't see its head, so can't see its head pattern. I really only see mostly belly. The belly's pretty clear. Mm -hmm. Um, I don't know. Typical, uh, egg cutting video here that we have no idea what it is until it gets out most of the time. That's because a lot of times we're hatching stuff we've never hatched before, right? Like if you're progressing in the hobby, every time you hatch a clutch, most of the time, it's hopefully something new for you. So it's very hard to tell in the egg what it might be, at least for us. You know, maybe people who've been doing this a lot, lot longer than us are a lot better at it, of course, but. All right, so that looks like a pastel, probably yellow belly, I would say. We'll see when it gets out, but I have a high likelihood that that is a pastel yellow belly. No pinstripe, no banana. Again, um, everything is going to be het desert ghost and 50% het pied. Come on, one banana. <laughs> I'll take one out of three. And I don't know, maybe that is a... I don't know. I've never seen a banana pinstripe, you know? Actually, now I'm thinking about it, so I don't know what that is. That's not a banana. That is a pinstripe. A pinstripe, yeah. Um, I can't tell if that's yellow belly or not. Maybe. That might be a yellow belly pinstripe. All right. Well, unless this one that I can't tell what it is, is a banana, which I guess is a possibility, though I'm not sure. I don't think so. I can't see much of it, though, um, other than the bottom of it. So I guess we'll see when these come out, guys. That's it for this cutting. Uh, so we'll be back when they shed out to show you what we got. Shed out time for clutch 14. So as a reminder, this was our banana girl to our 
Pastel Pinstripe Yellow Belly Desert Ghost Het Pied Male. Um, so both of these are 100% Het Desert Ghost, 50% Het Pied. Uh, here we have a Pinstripe Yellow Belly. Really pretty Pinstripe Yellow Belly. Here. And then the other one that we got from that clutch is a Pastel Pinstripe. If you can tell, no. it's a lot brighter nope, than not like... not Pastel Pinstripe. I'm sorry. Jeez. <laughs> a Pastel Yellow Belly. <laughs> Thank you, Holly. Um, you can tell it's a lot brighter than a, a straight pastel, uh, and the blushing's a lot stronger on the side. So, got a pinstripe yellow belly and a past pastel yellow belly out of that clutch. Uh, both 100% het for Desert Ghost, 50% het for Pied. So, that's the results for this clutch. Holly, you have anything else? Nope. All right, that's it for clutch 14, guys. Uh, like, comment, subscribe, all the YouTube stuff, and we'll see you next week. Take care. Bye, everybody.